Start off F30, okay, so no equipment, uh, workouts including warm up, workout and cool down, all done under 30 minutes. And the movements are normally quite basic. Okay, so straight away we'll delve into the workout. So it's 10 rounds, uh, 15 air squats and 15 press ups, which we'll come back to in a second. We're just gonna talk a little bit about the warm up. Two to three minutes on kind of the bike, rower, skiing or a run if you don't have access to any of them pieces of equipment. Then we want to move into some kind of mobility work. Okay, so thinking about the air squat, we're going to hit some hip and ankle mobility. Okay, just to kind of go through that kind of um, increased range of motion through the ankle and the hip. Um, then we're going to look at some band work on the upper body to really open up that shoulder and the chest in preparation for the air squats. Okay, and then we're actually going to go into the movements. So we are going to perform some air squats and some press ups. Um, and the warm-up's a great opportunity to kind of go through a full round to kind of give you a rough idea on how long a round is going to take you and kind of what your kind of limitations are with kind of this rep range. If you find yourself taking huge breaks throughout the workout, your, your, your rep range is probably too large. So we'd, we would recommend bringing that down, take a short break, and then allow yourself to carry on with the exercises. Remember our time frame, 10 to 12 minutes. Um, so think about your game plan and think about the rep range that is for your ability. Okay guys, warm up's done, um, rehearsal round's complete, so I've got a rough idea what my game plan's gonna be. Um, I, I'm gonna try and go and broken for as long as I can. I um, think I'll be okay on the air squats, um, and I'll just go pretty much on feel on when I need to break on the press ups. My aim is sub 10 minutes, let's see how it goes. Fifteen and cut. Seven fifty. That was that. Press has got tough. Press has got tough. Okay, guys. Okay, that's the workout done. Um, straight off findings is that um, the chest pump was real, um, and it massively caught me out. What the press ups did. 
So my game plan was to go and broke in for as long as I could. Um, for me, the air squats felt okay, um, especially through the first five rounds. I had the first five rounds done around about 327, um, which, which was probably a little bit too quick. Um, and then I had to start to use the air squats to recover because um, I had to break the press-ups. So from round six, I was breaking the press-ups. Um, and I think I finished the last round on a, on a six, a five, and a four. So three sets. Um, I knew I was going to have to break at some point, but I didn't really want to have to go down to three sets. So I went out too fast um, in the first five rounds. I finished in 7.50, so I'm pretty happy with the time. Um, but I have, I have got a 53 second drop off across the, across the, the, the kind of final five rounds. Um, if I did it again, I definitely would break the press ups right from the get go. Um, they, they just massively caught me out from round six. Okay, guys, hope that gives you a bit of a kind of gauge indication of, a, of, of the kind of the workout and the kind of game plan that, that kind of suited me. Um, come up with your, your own game plan and um, give it a go. Good luck.